This strange noise, first recorded in 1997, emanated from deep in the Pacific Ocean. Nicknamed the bloop, the sound was a powerful low-frequency jolt amid the eerie whisper of the ocean's natural movements. Its exact origins are still a mystery, but that hasn't stopped a steady beat of informed speculation. The bloop was first recorded by the U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, which maintains a program left over from the Cold War to listen to underwater sounds. In the summer of 1997, the bloop was registered about 1,500 miles west of the southern Chilean coast. NOAA heard the sound from 3,000 miles away, making it one of the loudest ever recorded underwater. What could it have been? NOAA has ruled out potential human causes, like a bomb or a submarine. One possibility is that the bloop belongs to an animal, However, the sound was much louder than a blue whale, whose call is the loudest known in nature. So the creature would have to be much larger or much better at vocalizing than any animal we've ever seen. Despite the resulting sea monster theories, Noah is unconvinced, suggesting the bloop only sounds like an animal because most recordings have been sped up 16-fold. Instead, the agencies offered a different theory. The bloop is actually the extraordinary sound of an ice shelf cracking as it breaks off from Antarctica. Here's what this so-called iceberg calving sounds like for comparison. And the bloop again. Today, this ice sheet breakdown is Noah's favorite explanation. But as long as we're speculating, here's one more. Hopeful HP Lovecraft fans have noted that his short story, The Call of Cthulhu, features an underwater city situated only about a thousand miles from the bloop's purported origin point. Hibernating in the city? Cthulhu, a giant winged beast with octopus suckers and the legs of a man. Let's go with that.